Although I could be in the Philippines right now, look at this. Sir, angel and the devil. Of course, be careful. I'm sorry, we're the disciples. <laughs> A bit naughty. I'm just walking around the corner and I'm like, my God, that smells amazing, like beyond amazing. And guess what it is? It's Jolly Bee. Good morning and welcome to a beautiful sunny Sunday morning here in Hong Kong. Right now I'm here in Central, which is on Hong Kong Island. Now, Sundays, for those of you that have been to Hong Kong know this, and for those of you that haven't been to Hong Kong, <laughs> then this is going to be a strange video. You see, Sundays in Hong Kong is the, um, the day off of the domestic helpers. So you have in Hong Kong roughly 400,000 domestic helpers, predominantly from the Philippines and Indonesia, the majority being from Philippines. Sunday is their only day off all week. Now, they work with Chinese families and Western families here. If I'm not mistaken, you're looking at one in three Chinese families with either an elderly person or a child has a Filipino or a um, Indonesian domestic helper. So Sunday is the day of the week they get to get out of the house, spend some time with their own community, have some fun and enjoy their, their, day, their day of relaxation. And a lot of you probably won't know this, but I have a, a, an affiliation with the Philippines in my heart. When I first moved here, I was adopted by a Filipino family. Uh, I was about 16 at the time, and they looked after me. I ended up moving to the Philippines. I spent a few years living there. I worked in the bars and the discos and the nightclubs as a singer in the Philippines back in the 90s. And uh, so for me, this is gonna be a kind of surreal moment. So without further ado, and my apologies for ranting and ranting, let's go and check out and see what a Sunday looks like in Hong Kong. Bathe you like a cigarette, love sick, I'm feeling it. You're not the one, but I still want you like the beat in my chest, love sick, I'm feeling it. I know you're not the one, but I still wanna light up. Bathe you like a cigarette, love sick, I'm feeling it. You're not the one, but I still want you like the beat in my chest, love sick, I'm feeling it. I know you're not the one, but I still wanna light up. Still want you on my body. This is the side of Hong Kong, a lot of people are surprised by. I think a lot of tourists get confused when they get off the um, metro, the island on a Sunday. The, this is, it's overwhelming. It's like, like mini forts, it's like being a kid again. I want to go and play. Wowzers. Are you getting your nails done? I'm good. I'm just walking around, isn't it? It's crazy all this, yeah? But it's a wonderful thing. This is the, this is the Filipino here. That's right, yeah. 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 Every Sunday, yeah? Absolutely. And you come and get your nails done every Sunday? Uh, well, I, I am today and next Sunday, yes. Well, enjoy. They look great. Absolutely. Colors of the Philippines. Yeah. Well, you can see the difference. You make all these videos. I don't even know if you heard anything in there. I, I, my ears are ringing. You make these videos and you get so used to being, you know, having nobody say anything. Look, everybody wants to say something. Hi, how are you? Where, you're all from the Philippines, yeah? Yes, we're from Philippines. Philippines, well, enjoy. Oh, can you do me next? Sure. Can you do my nails? Can you do my teeth? Can you give me different colored teeth? Ah. Uh, have a fun Sunday. Hi, everybody. Happy Sunday. Malaga in Pasco. Neely, Neely, Neely. Hi, how are you? What are you guys doing today? Going to party. Where, where do you party? Party here. So you, you have, you're drinking wine. Yeah, and you're going to sing. No karaoke? Have a fun Sunday, yeah? Bye-bye. Okay. They said they're gonna drink wine. I think they'd already been drinking wine. 
Hi, welcome to the club. Is this a club? <laughs> hey. This goes on and on and on and on. As I mentioned, you're looking around 380 to 400,000 domestic helpers. So this goes on and on and on. It's gonna be way too much to show. And to be honest, it's spread out everywhere. It's, it's, it's all the way from this area to Wan Chai. All the overpasses from the metro will be filled with Filipinos and Indonesians. Puts things into perspective, doesn't it? Let me get emotional. But it does put things into perspective. <clears throat> you know how happy everyone can be. You know, even though times are tough, you get through until Sunday and you can just forget about everything, be happy, basically be a human being again. And I'm not gonna make this a political piece, but I can guarantee the conditions they work and live in are not, not pleasing. And what's painful is they're such wonderful people, it's kind of effed up that it has to be that way. You can see everyone's practicing their dance moves. I don't know what practicing their dance moves for, but they'll put on shows for each other. So they'll literally practice some dance moves and they'll do shows. Each of the groups of women will do shows for their friends. The Philippines for music, for dance, for entertainment is certainly, in my opinion, the strongest country on the planet. And I'm gonna say it systematically, categorically. Their love for entertainment for music surpasses any any other country um, and I know some of you probably won't agree with me but a lot who know will so here's the metro literally you come out of the metro and it's like kabam it's okay Power of TikTok. This isn't planned, I'm just walking on the street. You see, they've got Born to Serve t shirts. There's two reasons they've got a Born to Serve t shirts. They're either. And they're throwing things now. Born to Serve, they're either a, a church group. Or, which I think is more likely, they're part of a biker gang. I taught them that dance move. That, that was my dance move. They, they're copying me with that one. <laughs> I'm not sure I'm not showing you anymore. This is I'm gonna <laughs> It's Queen Universe today. That's handy, Queen Universe. I don't know what the Queen is alluring to, as in a Queen or as in a Queen. I don't know anymore. I'm not judging. I'm just saying I don't really know anymore. A lot of these boxes here, this is what they call Balak Bayan. <laughs> So these boxes are where they pack up goods to send back to the Philippines. So all the little things they accumulate while they're in Hong Kong, they stick them all in these boxes and they ship them back to the Philippines as gifts for their families. Of course, Christmas is coming up. It's now November. So they'll be sending these now so that it arrives there on time. 
what what's in your boxes? Chocolates. Toys. Yeah, chocolates. What else? Uh, stuff toys, old clothes, bags. Yeah. And what? Chocolates. The very exciting is chocolate. Chocolates. <laughs> Hi. Hi. We're filming each other. Hello, shout out from Have a good Sunday, yeah? Enjoy. Always chocolates. Always. And when the lady said use clothes, they'll wrap everything so that the use clothes, which become a gift, <laughs> what they do is the used clothes is basically what you use to wrap everything. It's your protection. Your bubble wrap is used clothes, which they can become someone's new clothes. And maybe a little early. I don't see as many people eating. Normally, normally everyone's just eating and eating and eating. They all prepare food and they actually all sell food. So a lot of the ladies will have bags and hampers and things with all food in it. And then that food, they'll sell amongst themselves. A Filipino, a Filipino, a Filipino. Something smells incredible. Wow. <laughs> no, I honestly was not expecting that. I swear, I'm just walking. I'm like, wow. In some of the other videos, I've spoken about some of the smells and while nice, it kind of, you know, Hong Kong always has this underbelly of not so nice as well when it comes to smells. And I'm just walking around the corner and I'm like, my God, that smells amazing, like beyond amazing. I walk around the corner and guess what it is? It's Jolly Bee. Hey, how are you? Are you waiting for Jolly Bee? It's Jolly Bee. For those of you that don't know, Jolly Bee was set up in the Philippines as a competitor to McDonald's. Jolly Bee, hey, how are you? Hi. Jolly Bee for me is one of the smartest business marketing plans ever. Everywhere they put a McDonald's in the Philippines, across the road or next door, they put a Jollibee. And basically it's McDonald's, but it's owned and produced by your country. And one of the unique dishes there is because in the Philippines, they love their fried chicken. So basically it's like McDonald's, but with fried chicken and spaghetti bolognese, but that's another story for another time. And of course, McDonald's now in Asia, because of Jollibee, sells fried chicken, because otherwise it couldn't compete with Jollibee. But realistically, McDonald's cannot compete with Jollibee. Jollibee is phenomenal. Depending on where you live, depending on where you're watching this video from, if there is a Jollibee in your city, certainly go check it out. Look at these areas. Can you imagine this? Vente, vente. Hello to my black. Hi. It's just going to be a video of people waving. It's, uh, this video is going to be in the Guinness Book of World Records for most waves. Again, these, a lot of these things are what they're going to send back to the Philippines. All these boxes, you have the addresses of the families. You guys, you guys, you guys are really good. I thought, I thought he was the real Shakira. Little side note, something to bear in mind. We are like in the heart of Hong Kong Island. I mean, hence why it's called Central. But this isn't like an area that's given to the Filipinas 
the Indonesians, the domestics, you know, outside in the new territories of Hong Kong in some crappy area of Hong Kong. This is Hong Kong, Hong Kong, baby. So all this is going on in this area. I don't know what you compare it to in other countries. If this was France, we'd be, this would be being held every Sunday on the Champs-Élysées, okay? Or if this was um, New York, this would be Times Square. So it's a significant, you know, area we're in. Hi guys. You guys have such beautiful smiles. Of course. Of course, all Filipinos do, huh? Hello world. Hello. Hello. Everyone's so friendly here. Everyone's so happy. Have you guys been in Hong Kong for a long time? Yeah. We have six months here. Six months only? Eight months? Four months. Four months. You guys are like super new in Hong Kong then. You're like the new ones. You guys are the babies of Hong Kong. Well, I hope you enjoy Hong Kong. How are you? What's your name? Kang. Ken, nice to meet you. You live in Hong Kong? No, I work here. You're working here? Yeah. What's your work? Um, domestic. Domestic. How long have you been in Hong Kong? Six years. Six years. You like it? Yeah. It's good? Yeah. What's your favorite day? Sunday? Yes, of course. Nice. Yeah. Have fun, Ken. Yes. It's the emperor, though, yeah? Yeah. Long neck. Long neck? Long neck emperor. Though. I would, but... I can't. It's better this. I see Barangay Hinebra there. Say cheers, you drink. Hey, Kuya. Hello. Hello. Barangay Hinebra. Be careful. It's a, remember, look, it's the angel and the devil. Ah, uh, angel and the devil. If you get drunk. If you get drunk. Exactly. Yeah. What you know? That's problem. And Palutan. Sir. Angel and the devil. Of course, be careful. I'm sorry, you're the disciples. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, well, you know, this. Oh, we're in YouTube. Huh? When I was younger, I used to live in the Philippines. When I was younger. Oh, you come into the Philippines, really? I used to live in Camarin. 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 No, oh, Camarin. Calocan City. Oh, Manila. 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 Yeah. Manila. For me, no. I don't drink. That's right. Just, just one only. No, I, I can't. I, I will pretend. Oh, 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 that was oh, good. Oh. Just one only, brother. No. I don't, I don't drink. Oh, oh, and cool. you guys are going to be the stars. Hi, hey, from Philippines. Thank you, thank you. Only one. They just drink. Only one for you. Thank you so much, though, guys. Nice Have fun and enjoy your day. Sing some karaoke, yeah? A little bit of karaoke in here. Oh, many, many women here. You black <laughs> Hey guys. Hi Blacks. Hi. Hi Black, welcome to Black. Okay, everyone's selling clothes. It's like a full-on market going on here. Like, ooh, trying to squeeze through. This is nuts. It's like being at a Taylor Swift concert. Uh, see. Okay. I can't, I can't get in. What are you selling? Do I, do I want a bra? How alive is this? And this is the bottom of a bank building. This is a bank. Okay. So these are the escalators. And then it's all banking and finance. But not on a Sunday. On a Sunday, it's ours. Turn it around. You're waving at the back of the camera. 
This is bad. How long have you guys lived in Hong Kong? Me, yes, one year, 20 months. I'm EMC, I've been 2016. Since 2016? Oh, you're so lucky already. I love you. Nice loving you. Do you, do, do you like it in Hong Kong? Is it nice? Yes. Can we take a picture? Sure, sure, sure. Right. I know. I'm from Picture. Picture tayo. Picture tayo? Picture tayo? Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Pinoy naman ang puso ko. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Malagay ang Pasko. So, at the points of film, or oh, sorry, at the moments of film in which is now, I haven't uploaded any videos. I'm making videos to upload. So he's gonna be like, "What's your channel?" I'm like, "I don't actually have a channel. I've got a card with a channel address, but there's no videos there." I hope they still subscribe. They'll be subscribing to a channelless, a videoless channel. Well, it just means I need to get my my act into gear and start posting videos. Yeah, we need something I'd like to do and share these kind of experiences and trips with you guys. So let's hope that I do get to do this and keep the channel growing and and go to the Philippine Philippines. Although I could be in the Philippines right now, look at this. Just, oh! <laughs> oh. The, the juxtaposition of this, all this going on down here, combined with the skyline behind, it gives it such a different sense. I mean, you have crazy chaotic areas in Asia. I mean, it's bedlam beyond bedlam when you're in places like the Philippines or India. But when you're here in Hong Kong, in the financial district, and you have all this going on down at the bottom, it just makes it so much more surreal. But sometimes, well, if not kind of all the time, there's something wonderful when something's surreal. At least Filipinas in our camera shy. Hey guys, how are you? You having a nice time? Everybody has the long neck of Emperor. I love Emperor, but not today. A Fundador. That's it, Fundador. It's the same. You're the model, you're the model for Fundador. Well, you're just gonna have the, just the one bottle today between all of you, yeah? No, no, no. Two bottles. There are times three. It depends on. It depends on the mood. Yeah. How times three? Sometimes four. How long have you guys been in Hong Kong? Different. I am uh, eight years. Okay. Six years. Six years. Five. Five years. Six. And do you like it in Hong Kong? Yeah, I like most fun. It's good and bad. You're vaping. I. Vaping is not allowed in Hong Kong, yeah? <laughs> yes. No, because I vape. I can't vape. I come here and I have nowhere to buy. We, we, need, we know somebody who's selling. You have Where underground. Did you Where did you post that video? This video is for Pornhub. <laughs> <laughs> so, congrats. No, I'm joking. Of course not. Uh, you guys have a wonderful Sunday. Enjoy. Malagayan Pasco. Malagayan Pasco. Have fun. Yeah. Take care. You. Bye bye. What are you guys doing over here? <laughs> oh wow. Oh. This just became naughty. Oh. Oh. I can see a flash. Well, I'll leave. It smells very nice anyway, the, um, the eucalyptus. So enjoy. A massage, the bra rolls off everything. I mean, t shirt at the front, but still. Oh my god, you guys have like a buffet. What do you have? You have so much food. You have Shanghai Lumpia. Is it Lumpia? Is it somebody's whose birthday is it? Oh, she's mother. Can I take one Lumpia? Thank you. Shanghai Lumpia. Oh, is this? No, this is with. Chicken, pork, or banana? Chicken. Chicken. You can try also this 
one? This is a Filipino food. This one, I'll stick with this one. We call it turon. Turon. It's like the Spanish word. It's turon, yeah. But turon in Spain is different. It's not like a spring roll. No? And sarap and sarap and talaga? No. Grab it, ma'am. It's not crispy anymore. No. It doesn't matter. It's still really good. Well, enjoy your Sunday. Thank you very much for this. I needed it. Enjoy. Have fun. Why? Why are you guys dancing? Why are you all dancing? You're doing a video shoot today. Yeah, we're doing a video shoot where we, I danced uh, as Shakira, and the music is it's don't like. You look a lot better than Shakira. <laughs> I still love you, Shakira. Shakira, if you're watching this video, I had to say it. I had to say it. I had no choice. I was being polite. I hope you understand. Anyway, we're going to wrap up this video. It's been an amazing, amazing morning. Let's see if I can go through. Hi. 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 Hi, Philippines. I mean, it just never stops. All the hellos. I mean, it's a wealth of hellos today, isn't it? I'll tell you what, if I could take the amount of hellos I've had today and convert them into Bitcoin, I'd be rich. In fact, hi. In fact, if I could put hellos on the stock market just from this morning alone, I'd be able to retire. This has been an incredible, an incredible morning, full of positivity, full of happiness, full of joy. These moments truly are the ones I will carry with me, the ones I will remember. No matter how bad you're feeling, no matter how life may at sometimes, you know, give you a little bit, well, give you a few too many kicks when you're down. You come here on a Sunday, you see the joy, the happiness, and in all fairness from a, a group of people who don't necessarily have as much as a lot of us out there. But the one thing they do have which is maybe something we've lost along the way, or a lot of us have anyway. The one thing what they do have is their positivity, their joy, their sincerity, and their happiness. This has been Rick Meets World. Like, share, follow, subscribe. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. It's been a pleasure for me to have you along on this walk around Central on Hong Kong Island. Thank you very much. This is Rick Meets World. Hong Kong!